I've come back up to the upper Stour. It's very end of January. The river's in perfect trim, quite a good flow. I think the gate further down is open. I've dug out my old Shakespeare Annex XL match, which is 18 foot or 20 foot set up with 18 foot. Size 14, crow quill taking about 7 BB. I've got some liquidized bread and a bit of bread flake. I'm expecting chub, I'm, I'm going to see how I get on. It's a very mild day, so you never know. The black thorn that was here has been washed away. It's, it's right over the bank. So where I sat back in the summer, it's no longer possible to get there. One highlight I'm going to look out for, I've seen a, a red kite, which is the first one I've seen in Dorset for many years. But they are on their way coming round. This bread's a right studge now, just uh, chuck something up there. The long rod's meant to give better control. They're not wholly convinced it's a cumbersome thing. These long rods were all the rage in the late 90s, which is when I bought this one. Uh, a friend of mine bought a Daiwa 17 to 20. That's a completely different beast, much more powerful. This is it's more of a proper match rod, I suppose. I think this is the sort of rod you'd be better off fishing a still water. For me, it's too much like hard work. There are some really good 15 foot rods around that are light, that give you a bit of extra length. But although that this has got the length, it's just too heavy and unwieldy. It's a nice rod, it's got good action, but uh, it's too much for trotting for any length of time. failed to get any bites so far which is a bit weird I thought my the conditions are very good
Oh, I finally got a bite on a little smidgen of bread right underneath where the bread's been doing. And this is rich. Really weird playing a fish on this big long rod. Looks like a good fish. Gotcha. Seems to be hard to get him in. Ah, on a day when the boats have been non existent, hooked fair and square in the jaw. How about that? In fact, two and a half pounds. Very different on the long rod to the normal ones. Certainly plenty of chub in this swim. And uh, nice to show that it works. Like I say, if I was serious about long rods, I'd buy a lot lighter one. It's only been a quick video today, but uh, just showing that I can catch a fish on it. Just slipping back with the net. Didn't catch his breath. Hope you've enjoyed this video today just quickly uh, having a go with the long rod for a change and uh, show that it can help definitely good presentation the downside is it's far less wieldy i don't think this rod is as good as some that i use for playing fish things like the the normarks the carbotech and the uh, TriCast Allerton are very good rods for playing chub and I've struggled a bit with it but uh, I've used it on still water and had some decent fish sort of tench and bream and roach and maybe next time I give it an outing that's what I'll do until then it's uh, cheerio for now